Hey everyone, this is Rushlock. In this video, we're going to cover Alpha Valente Ratting in Nullsec. We're going to do a basic Vexor fit. We'll bring up on the screen for you real quick. It's always important to make sure that you are cap stable when you're using these fits. We're going to use a 100mm afterburner, a couple of cap batteries, Tech 2 cap recharger, four Tech 1 DDAs. Meta medium armor repper, three cap rigs, one DLA, and one flight of medium infiltrators. Tech one. You right click on these and show info. Go to variations. You're going to use infiltrator ones to kind of test out the, the method, make sure it's working for you. Then you can upgrade to integrated and imperial navy as your ISK allows. That's all for your fits and your gear. Let's go out to the sites. Sancha Rally Point. Don't confuse it with Sancha's Rally Point. The non-possessive, the one without the apostrophe S, is the one we're looking for. We're going to warp in at 30. Warp drive active. See you on the site. Alright, so we're going to come into the site here. You're going to see two lookout towers. I'm going to grab the one closer to the rats. Hit the orbit button. Run your prop mod. Brought your drones as early as possible before the rats aggress. Prop mod is on. Now remember, you are cap stable, so you can go ahead and turn on your armor upper. Early, late, doesn't really matter. Just make sure you do it before you take too much armor damage. But uh, wave one, let the drones do their own thing. Keep an eye on the destroyers, make sure they don't aggress your drones. But overall, this site has pretty clear uh, drone aggro issues. The possessive site, the apostrophe S one, will aggress your drones fairly often, so you want to avoid that whenever possible. But this is wave one, and we'll see you on wave two. Alright, so for wave two, we've got a couple of frigs and a couple of cruisers. We're going to primary the frigs down, then ignore the rest of the wave. Alright, so wave 3 is a bit of the same. we got a couple of frigs we're going to primary down. After that, it's going to be a set of battle cruisers. Drop these frigs real quick. And the reason for this is that if anything's going to aggro our drones, it's going to be the uh, frigates. Also, whenever you see loyal in the name, it tells you that they're kind of an elite form. They can be a little tankier, a little harder to hit. You can see our drones are actually missing a lot. If you want, you can either just AFK it and let them do what they want to do. You can micro it a bit and kind of put your targeting back and forth so that transversal is lost, but more often than not, it'll be fine. Just let them do their own thing with the frigs and get onto the battle cruisers. You for wave four. All right, wave four is up. This should be the most significant wave. Uh, there's a lot of battle cruisers and cruisers on this one. Uh, we want to prim primary the hellhounds, torturers. Typically do the most damage, but the wave itself is pretty straightforward. The sights is all just orbit and AFK. We'll let these spin, and we'll see you on the next wave, which I believe is the final wave. Alright, this brings us to wave number five, which will be a combination of battle cruisers and a battleship. If you want, you can primary down the battle cruiser, mitigate some of the incoming damage, but you can permatank it just fine. But finishing this site will also have a chance to cause an escalation. When you finish a combat site in Null, a pop up appears. You go to your journal, go to Expedition tab, the details will show here. If you want to know what you can do with a DED, you can either run it yourself or you can sell the bookmark to another player. Learn how to do that. Search for the video in our library for how to sell a DED. And I'll walk you through the process there. But that's it. This is a uh, roughly week and a half, two week train or less. Still working with some efficiencies on how best to spend the unallocated skill points. Or when you use a referral link, that gives you 250,000 SP. 
Plus, when you finish the new player experience, you get 80,000 SP. Most of that will go into getting Drones 5, which you end up with a little bit extra, about 50,000 in the actual referral SP. But, uh, yeah, you in a Alpha account in Nullsec, ratting combat sites, able to farm and gather up DEDs to sell to others, you can do this pretty effectively. Your clear time will improve as you improve your modules. These Tech 2 uh, DDAs, well, these are Tech 1s, but you can upgrade these to Tech 2s pretty quickly. Your drones themselves, we can improve to integrated and Navy drones that we showed at the beginning of the video. And all of this will improve your clear time. Uh, we'll post some more videos and more fits for as your skills improve to find more efficient ways to clear the site in a faster manner. But this is a great way to get started. And if you have any questions, as always, put them in the comments down below the video, or you can post them on our Discord server. The fit will be linked down below the video. We'll see you all next time.